you are told on the things of the world. My happiness is that I'm trusting you to me instead of hiding under the bed. What happened? And tell you that this is a lot to deal with, so please, I'd like to be left alone so that I can at least just think, okay? Why do you feel to see the fact that there is battle ahead? Why, my dear husband? My darling wife, I have eyes, you know, and I can see for myself what's going on. No, I don't think you can see it. Would you trust your husband if he tells you that he sees what's going on and that he has this under control? Of course I trust my dear husband. But the wife is equally saying the truth. Declare them your enemy and I will stand by you all the way. No, my darling wife, I'll be the last man to declare my family enemy. You're postponing the evil day. What I have said is the only way you will discover the best way to follow them. I didn't see this coming, you know. My father never wanted this kind of disunity. Is wrong with me building my own house and moving out of the family's house. That's growth. We can't read meanings into everything. Now, come on. Uh, come on. He supported me. He prayed for me. It would be wicked of me to understand his supporters, this unity. No, that's not my father. That wasn't my father. What? Your brother hijacked everything right before you. And he said nothing. Isn't that so? But I have never been interested in the family business. I have always wanted to do oil and gas. And my father at the time availed me all the contact, which I used, and I grew in business. Life has been good. Why should I be interested in the family wealth at this point? Can you reset to yourself? Alright, please, can we just change the topic? I know that's the next thing you're going to say. Change the topic. Anna. My daddy will soon be here. All right. What about your mother? It's not been long she went out. Is there anything I can offer you? No, 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 no. Don't bother yourself. You're sure? I'm good. <laughs> okay, let me continue what I was doing. All right. All right, dear. Hi, good evening. And how are you today? I'm very good. <laughs> Why? They have not offered you anything? No, 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 no. As if not, brother. <laughs> Why? That I'm married does not change the fact that this is my house. <laughs> if I did anything, I know where to get. You win. <laughs> I don't want the trouble of, of Umada. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting that uh, this is your house. You know everywhere. Even the wine store, you know where it is. You can help yourself at any point in time. No problem. You're welcome once more. Thank you. I learned that Chude Ben was at the family meeting for Papa's burial. And you walked him out. I don't get this. 
Uh, could this be the reason you left your husband's house to be here? I'm more interested why you walked him out. I walked him out because I don't want him to participate in the planning for the burial. Why? I don't understand why she's asking me why. I have told you that I do not want him to participate in the burial. I am able and capable of burying our father single-handedly. I don't want you to be able to contribute anything. Even your husband, you may tell him that I don't want him to contribute. We will handle it. Udoka. Udoka, you're making a very big mistake. Chitupem is our brother. And he must participate in Papa's burial. Now, I want you to understand something. That I do not want the trouble of Omada. It's on the condition that Omada should not want my own trouble. This is my burial. I am the Onoshilo B of this family. And I am telling you that I have decided how Obuefie Gomala Buba, our father, should be buried. This is a decision that everybody must respect. I shall come point again. Udoka. Have a nice day. Look at this your position before. Udoka, are you working out of here? Udoka. I've been digging, I've been digging, I've been digging. Allow me to bury Papa Money to let you. You might jack everything. No, 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 no. So, why did he say you're not participating in Papa's area? I don't know. Did you call him? No. You might have died. Did you go with him to the next level? I was with him. All day that they were together. As a matter of fact, I was with Papa when Papa died. Unfortunately, oh, it is sad. You know, the, 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 he, he was coughing seriously, and and Udoka had to run to the family doctor to get some drugs. Typical of Papa. He refused. He wasn't going to go to the hospital. So Udoka was doing all the running around, and I was with him until, you know. Face like that. What happened? Yes, Uncle. What is the problem? Is everything all right with Grandpa? What, what is, is going on? That Please is talk to us. That is normal. What? 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 What, what do you mean by Grandpa is gone? That is dead. I tried, I tried. After you left, you know, the, the, the cough the cough continued, it became severe. I I, I got confused. I didn't know what to do. I, but I know I tried to to save him, but he gave up. She didn't I brought you here. Because I need us to talk. I want to know what happened. Between the time I left you with our father to go to the hospital to bring his medicine and the time I came back, what happened? I don't understand. I mean, he was okay. 
when I left. Yes, but all I told you was all that happened. Yeah, he was very okay when I left. Very okay. He was talking. But I came back and I met him dead. Now how do we... Uh, uh, no, no, no. Hold on. Udoka. Are you implying what I'm thinking? No. Are you, are you insinuating that I killed our father? Is that what you're saying? Unconfirmed yet. You know, let me tell you something. A man as elevated as Ubuwe Fiego Malabuba of Umobogiri is not the kind of man they will have to expose to the ridicule of autopsy. Because when that happens, even small, small nurses who are not qualified to see his remains will see the remains and they will make a whole mockery of him. And I wouldn't want to do that. But if you force me to go for autopsy, I will do that. It becomes publicly monitored. Look, and why are you doing this? Come why? Come what on. have I done to you? Why? Why? You know me. I am your brother. Why? Even if you see someone that has my likeness in your dream killing Papa, would you wake up and believe it and accuse me? Mama? That is the reason I brought you here, for you to tell me what happened. You have brought me here to read it. Hi! Ha! But yeah, we are still brothers. After everything, you can still talk to me. I will not insult you. I will not be pushed to insult you. Therefore, I am not going to carry on with this conversation. Thank you. Even as he tries to hide it, I can still see there is something he is hiding. Papa was so sick. Even doctors gave him a I'm happy you know about this. I was honestly embarrassed by that question today. Why would he think so? Call him later tonight. See if I can talk some sense into him. Well, he would have to come to that um, reality sooner or later. How's your family, by the way? <laughs> We're fine. And your husband? Is he in the country? No, but I was traveling to Germany yesterday. Another business trip. <laughs> Anachia. Anachia. <laughs> She's fine. She stepped out not too long ago. Oh, she is, and she's not finding it funny. I wonder why he will refuse his brother from participating in the burial plan. Seriously, me, I don't know why you. I don't know, to be honest. I see war between those brothers. But I know the Ben will never agree to stay away from that burial. And Elibia Wago will never allow me to come close. And what is Chief's wife saying about this whole thing? That woman. That man traveled now. And I really learned that she's not coming back this weekend. So, who do you think she will stand with? Seriously, eh? That woman is guided by reason. And I see no doubt that she will stand with Chidubem or whatever. I don't know. Chidubem is the right person to stand with. Yes, because it will be of a great injustice if they sideline him from the burial arrangement. My friend, that one is their problem. 
Let us stand and watch them. That one is their business. Because this one is too much. Let's go. And let us sit and watch them. Let's go. This one is much. I'm a pure Because they I know want to bury their father. They should leave his cause at the much. Hey, that is their business. Because this one is much. Let us sit and eat very rice. Ah, sister. What you want more, Jiggy? Ella, you're here. Huh? <laughs> Does your father know that you are here? No, he doesn't know. Ah, I hope he does not harass you for coming to my house. Uh, no, he wouldn't. Uncle, let's discuss why I'm here. Oh, okay. I learned that my father said she will not participate in grandpa's burial. That's what he said. Did he say why? No, he did not say why. Are you going to back out from the burial plan? <laughs> no, I'm not going to back out. That's good. I mean, it's time someone placed my father where he belongs. Thank you, Ella, for your contribution, but uh, I do not plan on challenging anyone. It's not my style. If you do not challenge my father and force him to stop, he's going to gather unbelievable support from all these corrupt elders and the men of the vigilante, all to stop you. You know, I promised our father when he was alive a befitting burial. That is exactly what I'm going to do. Uncle, okay, okay, how are you going to do that when my father, the troublemaker, is standing on the road? Can I ask you a favor? Yes, Uncle. Can you help me find out why your father keeps insisting that I will not participate in our father's burial? I'd like to know. You see, I have a lot of things coming to mind as it is, but I would... Um, I'd like to work with specifics, you know. That way I know how to strategize. Oh no, that's that's fair enough. You've tried already. I didn't know you already asked. <laughs> it's not like it's in your place to um, have that kind of talk with him. I'll handle this. Um, is that something you'd like to take? Well, if there's food in the kitchen. Food? <laughs> it's okay. Help yourself, there's food in the kitchen. A man as elevated as Ubuefiego Malabuba of Umobogiri is not the kind of man they will have to expose to the ridicule of autopsy. Because when that happens, even small, small nurses who are not qualified to see his remains will see the remains and they will make a whole mockery of him. And I wouldn't want to do that. My love, hmm? what are you doing? I want to call my brother. Why? I want to know why he's insistent that I cannot participate in our father's burial. And you think he's going to tell you? I wouldn't know. Until I speak with him. If you ask me, I'll 
not say you shouldn't call him. Your brother Eliba Gwagu is so full of himself. He can go to any length to make sure you do not participate in that burial. He knows what he's doing. I need to hear from him still. Fine. You can call him. Who's that? It's your brother. Oh, God, God, God. God, God, what does he want? My love, you cannot tell until you speak with him now. I don't want to speak with him. He refused to take your calls. The signs becomes obvious by the day. I love talk to him now. Can I not wanna uh it's not enough for his Talk to him and know what he wants now. Do you know what? Mm -hmm. Switch off that phone. Switch it off. No, no. Get him out first. Know why he's calling me. Okay, now. can you call him and tell him that he is disturbing you? My love. Call. Just pick the call and talk to him. Hello? Ha! <laughs> Eli Baugwagun Kiz is no more. My brother, my blood. I greet you. Listen, I don't have time for all these nonsense pleasantries. Can you just go straight to the point? Well, in here, I am your brother. <laughs> and you and I should be able to talk like brothers, especially at this trying moment in our family. I don't have any trying moments. Can you go straight to the point and stop wasting my time, please? Um, well, I have called to um, know why you have refused to work with me and allow me to be part of the actual planning of our father's burial. You know what? I have a barrier to plan. And this useless question you have just asked me now is one of those questions I don't want to answer now. Don't call this number again. Get lost. What did you say? You dropped the call. <sighs> Your brother is planning something deadly. I can feel it. I feel I should cripple him with court injunction. Listen, Flora. Don't ever take this family to court. What I have going on with my brother is a minor family problem. I will go in to resolve it. Okay? Good morning, Duben. Good morning. I'm here to see my brother. Ah, please, hold on. Hold on. Why? Oga is not in the good mood to see. And I ask why? They are discussing about you inside. And from the look of things, you are the last person they will want to see today. They are discussing about me inside? Yes. Who are these people? Oga, the wife. And Adobe. 
Do you happen to know what they are talking about? It's not what I will tell you here now. I'll come to your house later, then I'll tell you everything. It's that serious? Yes, yes. I will come and see you later. Allow me to bury my father, it's my right. Allow me to bury Papa Mommy. Ibezim, the loyal driver of Ego Mala Ababo Mwabo Gede. And now, and now the driver of Udoka Elibaguago. Yeah, you're welcome. He called me to say that he sent you to me. And I believe you know why he sent me to you. You and Ezebilo rejected the money because Iche Okolo was there. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy you know. Iche Okolo is the sector of Umona and the head of disciplinary committee of Umobogidi. He France a bribery. That money was not bribery money. Are you serious? Yes. He gave you this money from his heart. <sighs> yes. Did he give it to you? Yes, I brought it. Yes, I brought the money. What he gave you before was 200,000. He now added 100,000 to make it 300,000. He just wants you two to be the one speaking for him. This is why I love Chief Udoka. He knows how to spend money. You know what? He's ready to add more. If only you can convince your friend to work for him. Consider it done. I will talk to Che Ezebilo today, today. Very? I will convince him today, today. Okay, that's good. But you have not collected the money. Of course. Uh, uh, I can't forget it now. Give it to me. I will give him his own share. Okay, let me today. put this the envelope for you. Do that. I will talk to him and then give him his own share of the money. Okay. And everything will be perfected. My friend, my friend. Ah, Ibezim. <laughs> you should know how I do my thing. I don't believe in hurry. In hurry, you stumble and fall and you make mistakes that would come without consequences. Yes. Mistakes that would cost you even more, so I like to take my time and get things right. Is that what he told you? Uh, listen, I, I know that's no, that was not a conversation. I made it clear to him that I cannot be in Port Harcourt at this time. I'm currently in the village, working very hard with my family members to give our father a befitting burial, so... Yes, that's what I said to him. Okay. <laughs> I'll be glad if you can do that. Oh, of course. I'll be happy to see you and the entire team. I mean, you're all invited to the burial. As long as our clients are happy and all the vessels are in good shape. What? <laughs> I'm busted, eh? <laughs> uh, that was going to be a surprise. Who told you? <laughs> yes, that's true. Yeah, I bought some new vessels from Japan. Very massive ones, yeah. The capacity should be between um, 2.6 to 3 million um, barrels. Yes. April, they'll be here in April. <laughs> oh, sure. oh, uh, And then I'll call you right back. Okay? Yeah. <sighs> Bye -bye. 
see who went shopping. I hope you got us something. Yeah. See who went shopping. No. You didn't. <laughs> Trust me, babe. You did not buy me something. Of course I did. I got you something. <laughs> you <Nick>. better. <laughs> <laughs> so how did it go? Very well. Okay. So tell me, how did your day go today with your brother? Um, not quite well. I didn't. Um, I didn't see him. Why? You couldn't go there again? I went there quite alright, but I, I didn't see him. Why? Is it that he didn't want to see you or what? Well, um, I got there and he basically advised that I do not go in. Why did he say so? Because they were having a meeting indoors about me at the time I got there. But that's not enough reason he couldn't meet you because you were there already. Well, um, Ibezim told me that um, me going in there could lead to more insults. So I saw reasons with him. I decided to take a step back. But he assured me that he would come here later to come tell me all that um, was discussed. Okay, not bad. That's okay. It's better to avoid troubles. Always. Always. So, what did you eat? I've just been hungry waiting on you, babe. And what do you mean by that? If you could just serve yourself. Yes, sir, Nazi. Always, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you need to eat good food before. I need you. You need food. No, I need you. I mean, what could be better than you? Food. No. Have you seen you? Even you would eat you right now. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Mm. I love you too much. <laughs> From the look of things, I think there is something you are itching to tell me. Um, you are right, Ichi Okleke. So what is it? Um, I've been itching to tell you something for sure. Udo Keliba Gwagu has done the right thing. The right thing? Yes. What did he do? He has sent some money through his driver without involving a Chiyokolo. So where is the money now? The money is with uh, Ichi and BC. Uh, but, okay, like, uh, mm. um, I need you to understand something. That money is not bribery. It is not bribe at all. It is some good money a brother gave to his brothers to help him in moving his immediate family forward peacefully. Eh? It is not bribery at all. That's there, all. There is peace already, okay, like, uh, There is peace already. Uh, only there was a little misunderstanding. Um, Okleke, let us help the Onochilobi and move this family forward peacefully. Huh? It's okay. Yes. I agree with you. Uh -huh. mm. There is mutual understanding between yes. us. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, we can go back. Mm. Uh, we can go back. Okolo. That is this room of flying around the village. I decided to keep quiet until I see you, so I can get it straight. Well, what you heard is exactly what happened. Udoka said Shidubem will not participate in the burial. Why? Well, nobody knows, because he did not tell us anything. Oh. In that case, I think uh, he's joking. No, it wasn't a joke. He said it with all seriousness. And I'm hearing that he's still insisting on what he said. Well, um, from my angle, I'm seeing it that he doesn't know what he's saying. Because there is no way Chidubem will not be in the burial ceremony of his own father. The same thing I told him. Exactly the same thing I told him. Hmm. 
All right. Summon a meeting of both of them. I want to talk to them. Okay. I'll do just exactly that. I will call them on phone on my way home. Please do so. Do so. <coughs> How are you, Shudiban? Uh, good. Uh, I just finished having a meeting with uh, Ichie Akuma. Yes, the, the moon ahead. And he has requested to see you in his house. Uh, tomorrow. Say, about 10 a.m. will be will be okay. God, thank you very much. God bless you, my dear. Thank you. Must bury my papa. Whether you like him or not, in a banana jam, if he get now, makina so much love in my so bad. Hello? Hello? Yes, I called you earlier, but you did not pick. Uh, well, I was in the middle of a meeting when you were calling me before. That's why I didn't pick the call. But I'm good now. Uh, I guess you are done with the meeting now. Yes. Uh, Mazi Akuma demands to see you. Is he back from travel? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. He's back. Good. Good. <laughs> so why is he asking for me? Actually, he wants to see you eh, concerning your preparation for the barrier. Okay. When does he want to see me? He, um, tomorrow will be appropriate. Say about 10 o'clock in the morning. Okay. There's no problem with that. I will see him. I will see him. I will see him. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you very much. God bless you. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, dear. All right, all right. Good. Is he Akuma? Is he Akuma? What will I do with you? <laughs> I'm a believer. Are you mad? Is something wrong with you? I'm talking to you, you're walking out on me. Are you mad? What did you just do? Did you just drag my clothes? Yes, I dragged you. Are you mad? Listen, I'll only let this slide because you're my elder sister. What the next you... time you do it. The next time you do it. What will you do? What's going what on? will you do? What will you what, do? What's going on? I asked this you... idiot a question. I demand an answer. And what is the question? I asked him what he went to Uncle Chudubem's house to do. I need an answer. Okay. If you must know. I went to his house to warn him never to come here again. You did what? Yes. Are you, why, why are you asking more questions? He just told you what he went there to do. Are you asking another question? And I, I, I feel he has done the right thing. Because that, 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 that man, that one you call, whoever you call him, children or whatever you call him, he needs to be warned. Okay? Yes. Simple. Excuse you? He needs to be warned by who? See, in the whole situation, he has done the right thing. Exactly what I would have done myself if I had gone there. Yes. He has done the right thing. I don't even understand what's going on here. Why are you talking about Uncle Chudubem in such ill-mannered way? What's it? And then he realized that he is no longer needed here and he moved. Why is he not coming back to this house again? He's no longer needed. What, 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 what is he looking for? So he needs to leave. You know, these were the same words I told him. Mm -hmm. Specifically. Mm -hmm. In fact, I added something else. I mm -hmm. told him he's no longer our uncle. Simple. I don't know why it is only me and you that reason like <laughs> our father's bloodline. This one is not understanding anything exactly what you're supposed to say. Be See, eh? I've been looking like, for like, I've been looking for an opportunity like 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 what you just did eh? to go and heap an insult on that idiot. Really? Yes. Really? Yes. As I'm talking to you, in fact, he's not going to participate in, in grandpa's burial. Never. 
It will never happen. Mm. Neither you nor anyone have the right to say that. No, you... Uncle Chidiba will participate in Grandpa's burial. Yes. This one is not in your hands to say. No, she has it's a right. Not in the mountain. Says who? Because this one at hand is way too big for you. So shut it. Okay? Keep quiet. You know, hmm? when I keep telling you that I am doubting the blood that flows through her veins, I'm not lying. Diverse stupid boy. You, oh, you've forgotten the capacity of your father. You've forgotten what your father can do. Hey, look, I am my father's daughter. No, we have to do a DNA. I don't care not. what he is capable of you? or what he is not capable of doing. All I know is that Uncle Chidubem will partake in Grandpa's burial. And yes, by your orders. He will not. He will. Just shut your mouth up. I have no to say that. It's not a thing to say. So keep quiet. And let us just end here. Stop it. Fine. Fine. Let just leave. It's okay. My friend, leave. No, go and force it. Don't touch me. Bam, up, don't see. you use your mouth to talk. Don't use your hand to talk. Oh. I see you. Oh. Madam, I see you. If I, if I Adam. stop. You only see your room, you are late. Uh, well, I'm, I'm sorry about that. I was taking care of something very important. But I'm here now. What is he doing here? Must you wake up every morning with this nauseating character of yours? What kind of question is that? You met me here. Oh, you see, I am not supposed to be in a meeting with this one. So I want him to leave. If anyone should leave, it will be you. Leave! You're the one who walked in here with a bad character. Leave! Okay, that is the case. I'm leaving. How dare you! If you dare walk out on me, the only self whom will conquer family. You will be the one to bury your father alone! I'm trying to control myself, to forgive you, to overlook your stupidity for intruding, for interrupting the natural and sacred process of Intunzu. And you have the mind to work out on me? Um, I didn't have time to attend to this matter yesterday. So now that I'm less busy, let's talk about it. Tell me what happened, Ella. Mommy, Eloka needs to be called to order. He needs to be cautioned. Ella, what is this? I mean, what is the meaning of this nonsense? Why can't you take my name off your mouth? What is the problem? Mommy, can you believe that Eloka went to Uncle Chitubem's house to go and warn him? He went there ready to fight, like Uncle Chitubem is an enemy. Why? I've already discussed with my son on this issue and an assurance has been made. You need to recall and understand that Chidubem has made himself an enemy to this family and therefore should be treated as one always. Once an enemy is always an enemy. Mommy, is that what you're saying? I just said the truth. Daddy is the one looking for trouble here. So I expect that you should at least call your husband to order. Shut your mouth before I shut it for you the, 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 the ugly way. Are you mad? Stupid. Ella, I am so disappointed at you. I mean, what is wrong with you? What is your problem? Why can't you join with your family? Support your own family and fight our enemy. Why? I don't, I don't understand. I that that will only happen where I see enemies. But in this context, there are no enemies. Because you are blind. You are so blind that you cannot see. Hey, look, that's an insult. I will not take it from you. I will not take it from you. Stop. Get out. He will insult you the more. And he will continue to insult you. Since you 
have refused to stand with your family in matters and in times like this because you just insulted your father, my husband. Mommy. Yes. How can I insult my father? But you did. I didn't insult daddy. I only stated the obvious. And he just stated the obvious. Exactly what Eloka did. Yes. I just stated the obvious. You are blind. Simple. So, why is there so much hatred from Gucci Ben? Because he is an enemy to this family. Mm -hmm. I don't know why you're behaving like a baby. This discussion is already dented. Initially, I was thinking we will have a very friendly discussion. But with what I'm seeing now, that purpose is defeated. Uh, no, sir. I believe we can still have a discussion. I don't think so. Well, uh, let me go straight to the point so we can return to our private business. Uh, I will appreciate that. Udoka. Why don't you want your brother here, Chiduben, to participate in his own father's burial? Is that what he told you? Udoka, answer my question. Don't respond to my question with a question. Don't do that. I see. You are not saying anything. Rumor has it round the village that you are insisting that he shouldn't participate in his own father's burial. Well, I, I know exactly what I said. What I said is that he should not be part of the planning of the burial. Yes. I don't want him to participate in the planning. I am still the only man of whom I and I have all it takes to bury my father. I don't need him to be there. Even in the day of burial proper, I wouldn't want to see his face in that compound. But he can go ahead because he has his own money. He can go ahead and set up canopies in his compound and entertain his guests there. Luckily for him, he has a very big compound. The person whose burial we are discussing is his own father too. Have you forgotten that? Uh, Ishii Okolo, I, I don't want to go into that. Uh, you are going to go into it. Because today I'm going to tell you exactly what I have in mind. I'm going to participate fully in the burial of my father. Take this time to tell this elders what you want me to contribute. Mm -hmm. I'm going to contribute. Yes. Even double. But you see that burial? I'll be very active. I don't want you to contribute anything. Unfortunately for you, you are not the one who caused the shot. I am still the only man who I am the one who caused the shot. And I am saying that I have all it takes to bury Obue Fiego Malaboba of Umobogri. Ah. The dog that has developed the habit of going around stealing, we call it develop the habit of receiving beating from every angle. Be prepared to bury your father alone. That is my verdict as only you see. And no one changes it. You want to claim everything for yourself. My love. Please talk to me. Tell me what happened. How did he go? He has bribed the elders. What? How is that possible? I don't know. But he has actually bribed them so badly. My love, how is that possible? Earlier today you told me the elders were on your side. So what changed? So I thought. But when I got to the meeting, I discovered that everything has already changed. Everything is changed. So what are the what are the elders saying? Useless elders. 
people that have already eaten bribe. What do you expect? They are insisting he must participate in the burial. Are you going to allow that to happen? Not when I'm alive, and you know that. So what are, what are we going to do about it? I still don't know what I'm doing. That's why I came back. I want to relax and think. I want to figure out exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. That means you need some time alone, right? I like you. I'll see you later, okay? Okay, cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Even when my father was alive, Shiakuma, you had a problem. And now that my father is no more, you see Akuma, you are still a problem. What do you want me to do to you? Shiakuma. It's my right to Allow me to bury Papa Money to let you You might jack everything on oh, now I love You take everything oh, It's a bad love I must bury my papa oh, Whether you like him or not oh, In a banana jam If you get now I Yourself, now I love. I'm a serious woman, so it's a bad girl.